Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome back to another react and recap video of Project Eight Six Three. Sorry if I went too a little bit too slow on that. I my brain didn't want to say. Uh. <laughs> I feel like all of these videos recently are just starting with like some noise from you and one of us going like, are you all right? <laughs> like, are, you, are you okay? But I had an idea last night. Okay. What's your idea? I would assume that's why we're gathered here. Dreaming about this stuff because one does that when they're obsessing over how to fix their lives. I'm trying not to be dramatic. It's pretty dramatic. But I'm not, I don't want to make people feel sorry for me either. I don't want to be like, hey, yeah, so we're trying to... Make it so I don't die. I mean, that's pretty much what's happening. Though. Subscribe on Spellbound. <laughs> we are trying to find a cure for you, and will it lead to death? Who knows? <laughs> Ideally, we should find you an antidote before There's, we figure out we, the answer yeah, like to that question. Everybody dies, you know? We have everybody no dies. leads. Anyways, like I said, is anyone else dreaming about this kind yes, of stuff. Yes. I did last night. I forget what it was, but I remember waking up and being like, oh, this is totally because of what's happening. Yeah. I fully had a dream last night, and it's kind of coming to me right now, that we were in a confrontation similar to the one with B-27 out there, yeah. and like two of us got stabbed. Speaking of B-27, speaking of Benjamin Cobalt, speaking of the man in black and red, I was reviewing in my mind the conversation that we had, and I want to swing something by subject four right now. Okay. I think we should go to Megadesk right now, and I want to better understand what he was screaming. I just have a weird instinct. He was screaming a bunch of numbers. But I thought they haven't seen that yet. Exactly. I'm going to I'm going to Oh, we are going to yes. look at that. Yes, and then wait Sorry. for some responses to see what up. Because wait. I feel like that's something. Wait. I feel like that's my only path, and there's no chance in getting any antidote, but there might be a chance in stopping that bomb. Shall we do it? Yeah, I'm down. Okay, cool. Woods, are you down? Are you sleeping a little? Yeah, a little sleep. Uh, yeah, okay. <clears throat> Everyone feel bad for Woods and not me. Oh, God. The perfectly healthy man. <laughs> So, if we're going back through the video here, he loses his mind about this spot. He says Virgo, and then he says 16, 16? 22. 22. So he says 16, 22, 01, right? Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna actually ask subject four here. We're gonna leak this part early. There were a lot of comments last time that were when I said this piece, which was, I'm not gonna spoil everything because there are some people that just watch us for entertainment. Like we still gotta pay the bills. <laughs> and a lot of people were like, I feel personally attacked in the comments. <laughs> Cause I was like, you're not trying to help us. Uh... So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the YouTube community feature because it's been very helpful so far. You guys have been very, very helpful. So thank you very much because there's just so many of you and it's like a hive mind and we all get together and we all big brain what the heck this means. And so that's my big question. Like, what the heck does this mean? A little help here. What could the following possibly mean? Virgo 162201. So posted right now. Everyone knows on YouTube it's slow for some strange reason. Eight seconds ago, there's two likes. That's not bad. So we're gonna wait for some responses here. And in the meantime, let's see if any of you guys have unlocked any more things from this whole mystery in Reddit. So let's take a peek at this. Got any games on your phone? <laughs> Flappy Bird. You have Flappy Bird on your phone? No, because didn't they discontinue Yeah, I was gonna that? say I don't think anybody does. Well, other than the people whose phones are worth like millions yeah. of dollars. <laughs> I heard a story that it just got so popular and he was making so much money that he just canceled it. it was, like didn't want it. Isn't that strange what? though? Yeah. It was like killing people. People were like not paying attention to oh. their lives. Oh. Uh, weren't there people that were like running into street signs like because they were playing? Yeah, what? and like driving. Running into street signs? Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> Still mildly terrifying though. Matt, 
You're shorter than I expected. <laughs> a little bit, yeah. Still terrifying. Still terrifying. He does look like 5'10 going off of Matt. Matt's six foot. I just added that. <laughs> I just can't believe he's a person. I feel like he, for yeah. so long, has been like just an idea, like a, yeah. like a monster type thing. <laughs> oh my goodness. What is Oh. Here is my, I'm not even going to say anything. This is so sad. Oh. I'm assuming this is Wes. That's so this sad. Is I hate these so much. This it's like because they're so heartbreaking. Yeah. But we also, like now, we don't even know if <laughs> that's true. this is accurate. Yeah, like this is still like romanticizing Deb. It's hard to break myself out of the cycle of trusting Deb. Yeah, when you see stuff like this that personifies, I don't know. Who knew that's all that Benjamin wanted to talk about? Hello. I'd like to talk to you about your <laughs> your car extended warranty. <laughs> uh, happy birthday, Woods. Happy, happy birthday, birthday, Woods. Woods, where's your hat? Oh, it's out in the lobby. I didn't come in here at 7.30 a.m. to put birthday hats on your desk for you to not wear it. Woods, go get your hat. There we go. Welcome to Tiny Hat Woods. There you go. Babe. Look at that. Yay. You look great, dude. Thanks, guys. What's your favorite gift you've ever gotten? The gift of life. <laughs> that just rolls Wait, I love this, like, you can't even see it with, like, the oh, way yeah. that Woods leans his head back. Come on, I know I'm not the only one. Hello, Benjamin. Oh. <laughs> this is the Doc Ock when he says, hello, Peter. Yeah. Hello. Benjamin. Oh. Happy birthday, Happy Woods. Birthday. Here we go. Back to Reddit and all the Woods scents. <laughs> well, it is his birthday. His birthday yeah, is the only day this, that I'll allow him for <laughs> give me Woods this, sipping. Give me just this one time, Matt. <laughs> just this one time. All the other times I don't need. Come on, hop on the simp wagon. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. I don't know if you actually want that. In honor of Woods' birthday, here's 35 seconds straight of Woods and Woodlands laughing. Woodlands. Woodlands, Woodlands, laugh, laugh. Woodlands laugh. laughing. Woodlands laughter. <laughs> you have the same laugh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, that was such needed joy. Oh, this is me and Benjamin. And back to this. I'm back to this. Scary. Woods making things be like. <laughs> Was it? I don't know. Sam, no video today. All sub before. <laughs> yeah, sorry guys. Oh, what? Happy birthday to Subject 3 himself, Woods. This is my first attempt at animation. I spent all night working on it. I hope it's okay. You wouldn't eat your breakfast. You wouldn't get in the shower on time. So now we're running late to school, Trevor. Just great. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? <laughs> it's a Vine it, or it's a TikTok. Oh, it's a TikTok? Uh, yeah. Okay. Mom, stop. I have to tell you something. <laughs> what in the f could you possibly have to say? I need context. <laughs> I forgot my backpack. Oh, oh, no. <laughs> Don't hit me. <laughs> <laughs> They're in the mountain here. <laughs> oh Sam, look, it's your, your green eye. What am I gonna do? Open the door, Josh! What? Okay. <laughs> I mean. Uh, <laughs> oh, aggro Sam. Aggro Sam. I feel it, Dad. I feel it, Dad. Happy birthday, Woods. <laughs> that was so strange. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, mega chairs. Sick. No, we don't need these. Oh, wow. <laughs> Just this one. Okay. That's it. You already have that. Hey, it's your birthday today. It's your birthday every day. <laughs> On Reddit it is. <laughs> Spirit change, sir. <laughs> so many memes. Oh. oh. That's I'm awesome. curious. Why? Oh, because it's the serum coming out of yeah. his eyes. And mouth and nose. B27 Whoa. Benjamin Cobalt. Well, that's creepy. Very good art, but creepy. 15 hours later. What? Oh. Whoa. I wish I had that. <laughs> Just caressing it. <laughs> we'll figure something out, Matt. Blueprints to multipolar devices theory. 
In the text, it says Benjamin Cobalt has experienced severe side effects due to the accident that occurred yesterday. The time bomb was on trial by Benjamin, and he destroyed his whole face with said time bomb. Or, on alternative theory, the picture that was under the note from Jordan was a picture of Benjamin and D. Now, if that's the case, Wesley got very frustrated and jealous and rigged the time bomb. I say this because, again, in the text, it says it was taken over by Wesley after a few short minutes. I think the bomb was in the room. Wesley locked the door so Ben couldn't get out and do... To that, it really messed up his face. Interesting theory. Interesting oh, theory. So this takes place way back in time, and yeah. they're saying Wes is the one that actually made this happen. Just a reminder that we haven't checked back with John Doe to find out what he emailed yet. I'm still curious. Also, I'll email you something I found in that car, and I'm sure it might be relevant to your scavenger hunt with Deborah. I don't remember. I didn't get an email after that, so maybe I'll have to follow up with him soon. Sam and Woods in location three. Watch Syntech video now. Watch Syntech video later. <laughs> <laughs> Deb and Wes. Ah. I'm sorry, I couldn't save you from him. From I guess they haven't seen that video yet. Exactly, yeah, right. So that's why all this fan art is still like portraying Deb in this nice light when we know the truth. This fan art is going to get real dark. Yeah, this fan art is going to get real <laughs> dark. Woods, Woods. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Oh, what? the flex. Yeah, they're talking, they're talking about the flex. After we cut the bolt off the desk <laughs> and Matt that. went, flex. okay, go ahead, flex. Yeah. Now flex. Flex. What's up? That was all me. No, <laughs> you mean. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I think that that's one of my favorite moments of Project 863, yeah, if I'm being is. completely honest. Yeah, that was all me. The cabinet they found in the storage unit. The table they found in the storage unit. Uh, Matt Sam Woods. Oh know, yeah, we haven't checked I that. I completely forgot. We'll have to check that soon. My heart, when watching overnight video, seeing Wes's tombstone, Woods sleeping, seeing a fan, wait, why Woods sleeping? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Trying to piece together the clues for who did the thing in the vehicle. Undercover journalist Kendall sparks interest of Deb because of Kendall's vast knowledge of some of the ongoings of the company in Syntech. They invite Kendall to join them, the team at Syntech, possibly fully aware of Kendall's side hustle, journalism, and reporting. From there, they possibly join forces, Kendall trying to help Deb reveal the horrific reality of testing behind closed doors. Kendall still has to be quick with the photographing, so it's best to say that the blurred images are more of Kendall's reporting. Kendall possibly gets caught taking photos so Wes confiscates the camera. From there, Wes starts worrying about the truth of Syntech being revealed and completely hide the images and the camera, but B-27, based on the recent episode, finds this and possibly uses it as leverage against Wes. B-27 framing Wes as if to say, you have the camera, you are trying to ruin Syntec. Oh, from here, I want to assume that this fight between Wes and B-27 turns into a late night conversation in the car in the middle of the car park in which B-27 gets the last word. No. It's not that, guys. Yeah. Interesting theory. Though. But here's the thing about this. Kendall, for instance, though, that Kendall from West doesn't even know basic biotech terms. Mm -hmm. So that's something. Deborah's solitude dream that never gonna saturate. Why don't we think it was Kendall? We found evidence that it wasn't Kendall. We found evidence that Wes was good with Kendall. Hello there, General Matthias. Yes. <laughs> oh, that's good. For some reason, the Phantom has this menacing vibe. I think Matthias is under-leveled for this mini-boss battle that's about to happen. <laughs> under-leveled. Under-leveled. How under -leveled. does that feel, Matt? Oh, uh, yeah. To be told that you're under-leveled. I'm under-leveled. This is basically how Syntec Love Triangle went down, right? <laughs> Case solved. Okay, so Benjamin Cobalt's The Phantom. Wes is dead. We have the footage of the murder, the murder scene, and, and the remains of what Wes wore on the night it happened. And now we have a couple of possible motives. Anger. Benjamin seems... Yeah, this is what... This is everything we thought, too. Case solved. Is it time to report back to dear old John Doe? Yes. Right after we had the conversation with Ben, who then gave us the true evidence that it was Deb. Yeah. I think that's just a reflection. Yeah, it's just a reflection. That's dope art. That's, That's very cool. If you had like backup there. Oh my gosh, if there were other fans. Fan. And we didn't even know. Deb has said numerous times that he's been building, you know, for lack of a better word, an army all this time and recruiting people. Mm -hmm. Understanding the circuit diagram. Oh, this was the circuit diagram that we found in the desk, right? Resistor, diode, capacitor, transistor, switch, inductor, integrated circuit, liquid level sensor, pump. Wow. Nice. <laughs> After seeing the circuit diagram, memories from college physics and robotics kicked in, and I started trying to figure out exactly what it does do. It. Short of actually doing the math to find the current and such, I was tempted. After a bit of a refresher, it looks like the diagram is a timer circuit for the serum dispersion device. Basically, there's a switch that's flipped 
that starts the timer. The timer counts down, sending a signal that starts the pump, which runs until it's shut off by the liquid level sensor. In theory, if you were to interrupt the circuit somehow so the timer didn't send the signal or were to potentially get the liquid level sensor to fire off the signal that the levels were inadequate, you could potentially shut off the device. Interesting. Granted, I'm not an electrical engineer or related, so if someone can correct me, feel free. Wow, this is awesome. Wow. Thank you so much, Steph. Meet Richard Ritchie Kingsley, a research scientist for Syntec. He also happens to be good friends with Lee and Claire. Enjoy. That's funny. That's cool art. Look at this. This is so cool. We tracked GPS to a stolen car to an abandoned location episode in board game style. Oh, that's so sick. Oh, that's so cool. You can see like it tracks and the little drone right there. This person Whoa. needs to design a video game. Red light therapy in the phantom mask? Small mm -hmm. thing. This was something I looked into a while back but dismissed after some research thinking I was on a red herring. But after today's video, hearing them talk about B27 potentially having been blinded and his face being damaged brought up this older theory. Red light therapy. I actually have red light therapy at my house and I notice it actually helps. Promotes wound healing, improves hair growth. Oh, I didn't know that. I should put it at the top of my head. Uh, help for the short-term treatment of carpal tunnel syndrome. Stimulates healing and slow. Yeah, it engages the mitochondria. Reduce psoriasis lesions. Oof. It's release pain and inflammation in people with pain in the Achilles tendons. Well, it also does it with people with costochondritis. Oh my. Oh, yep. scary. That's very scary. Oh, is uh, he holding the, the absolute? Is, I think so. Yeah. yeah, I think he is. Neck lice. <laughs> because it was on me to help them. Oh, yeah. That's me. That's sad. Matthias angst. <laughs> okay, let's go back to YouTube and see if anyone's got any ideas for us in terms of what this whole thing means. 282 comments. Oh, wow. wow. Okay. That's a good sign. When you write in Google, a tarot reading comes up. It references the headlines that someone is about to surface back, possibly resurfacing of Wes after revelations you may have had. What? Virgo is an astrology sign for the dates August 23rd to about September 22nd. So maybe a phantom that is a Virgo is going to be at those coordinates. Oh, coordinates. Coordinates, interesting. Virgo could be the name of another project. We're in season now, so August through September 22nd could be the code name of a person born in this time too. 22-16-01, or is it 16-22-01? It's 16-22. Yeah, okay. So Virgo on the zodiac wheel is the same place as one o'clock. So I'm thinking that either mean a time or a direction. And the numbers could either be coordinates or a time or a lock to a combo. Does 16-22-01 make sense with coordinates? Like that's not in coordinate. No, no, Minecraft coordinate format. <laughs> Virgo sounds like a zodiac sign. As for the numbers, possible coordinates or a code. Could be a lock. Sixteen twenty two oh one feels like it would be a date, but that's not how it's, dates yeah. work. There's no month. There's 16th. no sixteenth month. There's no twenty second month. Virgo is a zodiac sign, and sixteen twenty two oh one is either a time coordinates, a lock combo, or a jumbled up date. Perhaps Virgo refers to more than just the zodiac sign, but it could also be referring to exactly today. Today, September sixteenth. Why? Twenty two oh one. That is also when the sun first coincides with the Virgo constellation. Twenty two oh one. So that would be tonight, right? Unless the one is yeah, like this person says, or a jumbled up date. So it could easily be this. It could easily be sixteen twenty twenty one. Okay. Virgo, which equals nine. 9 16 2021. That's today. Why today? What's supposed to happen today? Oh man. The bomb. Today? Why would he tell you the day of the bomb? Maybe I mean, it slipped. Why would he? He was going crazy. He, he's going crazy. He's letting things slip. Okay, but so that's today. What are we supposed to do with that information? Oh. Somehow find it. Wait, 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 wait. Large amounts of radiation. Large amounts of radiation. Mm -hmm. Remember in the video that we were uncovering all the things in the desk and we thought that the previous location that we went to was him testing the bomb. Yes. Then I accused him and I said it was all over. We know what you've been planning, it was all over. And then he said, no, it's not. Mm -hmm. And this time he won't fail. So that almost confirms that the previous location that had the massive spike of radiation that we were too late for. Yeah was him testing the bomb and he failed yeah. and this time he won't but why is his brain like splitting to give us this information because he's crazy yeah i mean he's oh. obviously not in his right mind oh my gosh i'm so stupid <laughs> follow me here 
I turned off the RSD because we're not using that anymore. Yeah. But now I think we should go turn it on. Because if he's still working on this prototype or something, <clears throat> we and it we caused a it. large spike of radiation last time, maybe there's something new on the RSD. Exactly. Can we go turn it on? Yeah. Let's do it. Okay, okay. I turned it off just simply because well, I guess Deb told me to, but it was another thing where it was like, stop searching for the serum, stop doing, this thing's loud and obnoxious. And again, if we weren't using it, why would we leave it on? Exactly. Now I'm kind of wondering if she wanted me to stop finding serum and formula on purpose. Right, exactly. Uh, I just like, I'm so distrustful right now. Mm -hmm. I, I think that's the biggest something. thing. Like she didn't want us to look for the serum because she- She was up to something. Exactly. Exactly, exactly. Er, it's loading, it's loading, it's loading, it's loading. Okay, run. Oh no, that's not good. Uh, <laughs> it's no, already going insane. off. Okay, wait, that's, that's close. That's, that's in town. Wait, that's, that's actually so close to us right now. Okay, guys, we gotta we gotta move literally right now. We gotta go right now. Wait, hold up. Write down the coordinates. Yeah. Take a picture of that. Uh, follow me. Follow me. Okay, Woods. Right, I, got I need you to grab a Geiger counter. Can you do that for me? Okay. I want to know the radiation levels because I don't want you guys getting too close. That's the same symbol that we saw last time, but this is in a populated area. What if this is already affecting people? What are we gonna do? Where Maybe would it's gonna be? be there. Like Maybe it's just out in the it. open. I don't know. I think we should at least go out there and see what's going on. Mm -hmm. If there's no real chance for us to do anything, maybe I can like reason with him again. Maybe I can try and have another conversation. Maybe we can call him again. Maybe he wanted me to come. I mean, I don't know. It seems like he's trying to hurt people. Let's go. I'm gonna prep the car. So, <sighs> see the bad part about this is that we have no idea how long that thing's been going off. We could be no. totally too late, just right. like the first time. <laughs> if he had a successful, a successful prototype thing that No, went just a successful run. Yeah. Because he, he was like, this is it. I'm not gonna fail this time. Isn't he the creator of the prototype? Or was that Wes? That was Wes. So I'm assuming he's been trying to steal all these things and trying to collect all the formula and whatever the absolute is so that he can recreate this. So that he could infect millions of people. Well, and I feel like it goes back to the whole love triangle of it all. The fact that Benjamin is trying to use Wes's creation. I just can't believe that he's planning on killing all of these people well, just for Deb. I, I mean, do we know that it's killing if it's I'm not dead. with serum? Matt's it not dead. Me. But also B27 isn't dead yet. I'm not saying that this was like gonna be a great thing, yeah. but I don't. This is the way to live, guys. I love all the pain and all of the strange mm -hmm. happenings that I'm experiencing in my, in my body lately. It's super fun. I love it. Guys, when we get to this location, I'm not gonna pull up super close like I did last time. Like we pulled into the zone. Like Woods and I did that little high five and we all agreed that we were gonna die young together. <laughs> if in like 20 years, we all grow tumors of some sort, we'll call each other, we'll go out together. <laughs> So this time, I don't really want to do that because like, I know what's at stake here and I don't want you guys to have that experience. What we're going to do is we're going to pull off, we're going to get out, and then we're going to slowly move forwards. <sighs> because I have no idea what's going to go on. I mean, now is the last chance if you want to bail. <laughs> Maybe this thing won't even go off. Maybe it's already gone yeah. off and we don't even have a chance. Who knows? I'm willing to find out. There are things out of our control. Okay, so we're going to come up here in about a minute. Do you have it on your phone, Sam? I do. Okay, cool. This is it, right? Right here? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Woods, can you turn on that Geiger counter? No. This is starting to I'm, <laughs> look familiar. Uh, yeah, we're getting closer, but we've been here before. Yes, yeah, right around the area where we like tricked him to come. Yeah. 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 Is this the same area? This is the same location that we lured him to. Yeah, I'm getting readings. You You're are? getting readings? Yeah. Is it high? It's high. Okay, hold on. I'm, I'm stopping yeah. then. We're gonna walk to see if we can get to a place where uh, I'll go alone, I guess. I'm already infected. Why? Let's just do Let's this. Get out of it. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, there's only so much talking about this kind of crap we can do. So yeah, watch out, is, there's there's some traffic. This is the same location that like Woods and I were hiding in back there. Why would it be this location? I don't know how much this guy's into games, but if this is a location that we lured him to, what are the odds that he's using this as a location to lure us to? Yeah, like hold up, hold up, hold up. 
Hold up, listen, okay? These readings are getting relatively high. Nothing that you guys can't shake off. I don't want you guys going past this bush, okay? Seriously? We're gonna stop at this bush. Do you understand? I don't want you going past the bush because you don't have serum in you. Do you understand that? It does make sense with what we know about the serum that Matt is more suited to be exposed to more I radiation might, than we are. Exactly. I might actually be immune to radiation. Just, just promise me, you don't go past this barrier. But what if something really bad happens? You don't what go if past he's it. there? You don't go past it. Do I have your word? Yes. Yeah. Quiet, quiet. I want you guys to be quiet. There's a massive U-Haul. Is that it? That's definitely where it is. This is getting relatively high. This is like the amount of radiation that's acceptable for you for a year. Wow. For a full year. So don't go in and get any CAT scans or x-rays next year. <laughs> uh. So now what? do what? we do? Like, if this is happening right now, do I go up there? No, get down, get down, get down. No, no. I think that's kind of the only option. Why what? don't we just wait it out a little bit? Yeah. If there's a timer, how do we know how much time we have? If this is a bomb, my guess is he's going to leave. I mean, that is true. If this is some sort of, like, serum dispensing contraption, he's probably going to leave before it goes off. What if so he's maybe already that left? gives us he's already, some yeah, time. Maybe, what if he's already left? That's yeah, true. so should we go? Wow. That's a tough call. Um, I say we wait half an hour. Uh, half okay. an hour. I'm going to be looking at these radiation readings. If this is getting higher, that might mean something, and that might cue me to go. I don't know. I'm, yeah. like, I'm working with limited information yeah. here. What this is grass. this place? Why would he pick this place of all places? Again, that, like I think it might be a mind game, because this is where we tried to lure him to put the tracker on his car. He knows that. So my biggest concern here is what if this has more to do with luring us here? This place is right in the middle of the city. This is not, <laughs> he's literally intending to put this off in the middle of suburbia. Why would B27 want more people to be infected with serum? I don't know. I would think he would have this justice complex of trying to make sure that this doesn't happen to other people. What if he wants more people to be like him? Like for his greater purpose? Well, either that or maybe this is coming higher up. Yeah. Maybe this is Nelson. I think we keep forgetting that Cyphus is his boss. We yeah. don't know anything about Nelson. We really don't know anything, but B27, not that long ago, did still make a comment about, I don't want to have to tell this to Nelson. Hard to say. Guys. What? Guys, it's moving again. It's moving the again? The U-Haul's moving again. Don't pop your head up. Wait, do you see that? Yeah. It's a little cracked open. Someone's inside that. Oh, shoot. What? What? He's, it's him. He got it's out. Him. Stay, stay down, stay down. He got out. He's leaving. Oh my gosh, he must have just armed it. He's literally leaving. Is he in a rush? Ah, uh, yeah, he seemed like he was in a bit of a rush. This is it. I'm uh, going. Okay. Listen, I'm going to have this on me. Okay. Uh, I'm going to have this on. Uh, I'm going to have this on me right now in case radiation gets too high. Okay. Uh, it is what it is. Hey, you guys stay down. Okay. You understand? Okay. Call us yeah. if you need us. I will. Okay. This is not good. This is not good. The truck is still on. He left it open. He left it open. Here we go. Oh my gosh. What is he doing? No, 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 no. Where's this? There's no display? Is this a keyboard? What is happening? Oh, God. Wait. Look at this. What is that?
Did that do it? No way. What on earth is this? Is this the absolute? It literally shut off. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, he's getting out, he's getting out. He's got the necklace. He's got the, the necklace. He has, he has Wes's necklace. What? What happened? What was in it there? It shut off. It, it stopped? It actually shut off. It shut off on its own? I pulled this thing out and it shut off. That that's the missing piece. Get down, that's get down, what, get down. He, he might return. That's what Wes had around his neck. Necklace. What that's is Wes's it? Neck. I have no idea. Does that make sense? He had it around his neck? We'll put it on. That, I mean, that's like it. As long as the I don't want to lose was. this thing, man. No, okay, put, put it, it on. on. Holy cow. So you said you just you took it out and it, it completely turned it off. I mean, B27 did say that that was the missing piece he needed for this. How this big was it? it? It was huge. Really? <laughs> it was bigger than me. What do we, what do we do? Do we just... We can't just leave, leave it, it there. Well, hey, we have the key for it. The necklace is the key. It literally shut down. The second you pulled that the off. The second I pulled this out. He's gonna come after us. He's he's gonna know that we have it. He's gonna come he's after he's us. gonna know that it didn't that go off. Unlocked. And it was just unlocked. It was unlocked. So what do we he's do? He's coming back. What do we do? We have to go. No. No, we wait. We wait. And do what? We wait. He investigates. We trap him. <gasps> You're gonna lock him You're in the U haul. <laughs> Is and then that, do what with him? What are you going to what, what what do, do? do with him? Just leave him there to die? No, I'm not going to leave him there to die. We're going to drive this thing. The U-Haul is running. So the plan is he comes back, he goes in there, you run out, lock him in, and then where are we taking it? What? Damn, studio? it doesn't matter. There's no time. Okay. He's going in now. Okay. Go. go you go, told go, us go. not to go past the bushes, I Matt. know I told you not to go past the bushes, but the bomb is disarmed. He's not going to know. So we're safe. I need your so help is, in case. Okay, look. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Is it still Come radioactive? On. It's not like radioactive anymore. It's disarmed. Follow me. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Hold it down. Hold it down. Hold it down. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Okay, let's let's. I didn't lock it. There we go. There we go. Get in. Get in. Come on. Come on. Come on. Go. 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 Get go. Get in. Get just in. pile in. Just pile in. Quinn, we'll meet. We'll meet you where we end up. Okay. Okay. Where's that? We're going to the police station. Okay. I want to confront Deb about all this one last time. Confront her with everything we know and say that we're done. Make sure to check out our new merch design. And that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. <laughs> what a wild, wild, wild.